Hey guys, it's Nutcase, and this is my third time recording this video. Let's see if I can get this going. Um, Alright, so this video, I'm doing a extra video this week uh, just because I wanted to put something out there to kind of say my view on this. So a lot of you have been seeing on Twitter, Tumblr, everywhere on the internet, Bowsette. Uh, and that's awesome. I love seeing artists having fun. I mean, I loved drawing it too. Uh, the last end of the video is my Bowsat art. But um, one of the things I've also been seeing rampant is people uh, posting and sharing art without crediting the artists or even editing the art so the artist's like, watermark is not in there. Uh, now, I'm a full-time artist. I make my money off art. So when I do fan art like this, I share it with my watermark, with my information on it, and the chance that someone might commission me because they see my art. So I'm doing this as, you know, a here, the internet, you can have this picture, but it's also a self-promotional thing for myself. And I feel like it's the same thing for a lot of other artists. When we do memes or things like this where it's like a popular trend and post them we know it's gonna get shared we know people are gonna do that like that's why we're posting them and that's why we're putting our signatures and stuff on them but when you don't credit us or post it and take our signature off so people who are maybe interested in finding out who we are it hurts us i mean you know I I know most people aren't making money off of the art by reposting it, like on Imager or on Reddit or on any other site, but besides you claiming it as your own art, it does not make sense to me why somebody would post it like that. Now, claiming it as your own art is just art theft, obviously, and, you know, <laughs> people don't like that anyway, so... But for some reason, it's okay to post it and just not tell people it's not your art and where you can find the artist or anything. Uh, but yeah, the reason I wanted to make this video is because, again, I've seen it a lot because of the Bowsette meme, and I've seen even YouTubers using art from artists, and YouTube doesn't protect us as a, you know, drawing artist, a image artist like this. I don't I don't know how you would classify this versus like just artists in general, but videographers, musicians, even photographers are more protected on YouTube than uh, like say I am. Like if somebody uses my image in their video because it is just an image and unless they use it for I think it's like more than 30 seconds or whatever, I can't do anything. And sure, my one image isn't going to make the difference for their video being seen if it's just there for an instant or whatever, but it's not just me that they're doing that to. They're sharing the art of other artists and not crediting who they are. And when you're on a site and that's where you find the art, and it has the artist's tag, name, and stuff right there, why would you not just share that? It's not hard to include that in your video, because then that's at least crediting the artist some way. It's at least letting people see who drew it, so if they want to go find it, they can. I don't know. I just... Again, I wanted to make this video and kind of just rant a little bit about how I feel the internet feels entitled to do whatever they want with art that artists share online. And there are people that will tell me, well, if you don't want that, then don't share it online. But that's the thing. I need to share it online to get business. And being able to share it and have people see my watermark and everything on the image and being able to be like, oh, I like that one. I want to go follow them. And then they see, oh, she does commissions. Let me commission her. Like, it doesn't happen a ton, but it does happen sometimes. And that's just how one way for us artists can advertise is by drawing fan art and sharing it with you guys. It's something that we all like. Like, you know, if I'm drawing something, if it's in my own time, I'm usually going to be drawing something I like. And so you're going to know that like, oh, well, I like this and I'd like to commission something like this. 
you're going to already know that I like that because I've already drawn something like that. But yeah, sorry. This video got really ranty. Not as ranty, ranty as the previous versions, but yeah. I just wanted to make this video. Uh, I'll have an extra video coming out Sunday for Inktober, just so you guys know. Just to kind of not have the weekend like this on my videos. But yeah, I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!